我的爸妈很爱我，但我却总想着逃跑。我跟你好吧，工作这样辛苦，才赚这样一点钱，你在学校就节约一点，知道吗？不要跟别人比，人家怎么条件，我们讲怎么条件，比不起。知道了。今天晚上可以吃啊！第一次我跟你爸爸吼、哦、吃饭的不是吃酱贵的。今天你回来，我们就去吃餐馆，吃大餐啦，走走走。我们在家里自己出来。我觉得这个衣服啊，都穿了三年，都没有进去，你就好了。衣服穿了一年就不要穿了。走。我买新的衣服给你们了。算了啦，我跟你爸爸都过惯这些苦日子了，想一下来把你养这么大，我跟你爸爸牺牲了多少？谁叫你们牺牲了？你们觉得这样辛苦，为什么当初要等我？ Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. All right, as you guys can see from the video title, today I want to talk about my parents. Yeah, actually I come from a well-off family. My parents are both hawkers. They have a small hawker store of their own. They go out to open the store before dawn, and they will come back to rest at noon, and then they go to open store again at night until midnight. I remember when I was a child, our family owed a lot of money because of the failure of my father's business. At that time, we really couldn't eat enough for three meals. I experienced with the only white porridge with soy sauce. It was really a poor life. I remember I was naughty when I was a kid and always caused a lot of trouble at school. My mother always need to go to school to help me solve a kind of problem. But after I start sensibly, I have realized that how much they love me, and they will buy me whatever I want. So I start to study hard. So I am in the college today. Our parents did their best. The best thing they can do under their cognitive level is they raise us, and at least they fit us to live healthily until today. It's not easy for them because we don't know what they experienced before. Therefore, when we blame them, complain about them, it just makes us immature. And if we want to be mature, we should try to accept them, and understand them, and love them.